So we're all college kids, you know, we need places to store things. Right. Yeah, so what do you got for us? Well, you know, college is a tough time. It's the time that you're learning and growing and having sex for the first time. So it's very, very important that you do things right. And Tupperware is perfect. A lot of people think, oh, Tupperware, that's for old ladies. Uh -uh. It's perfect for college kids because, first of all, it's got a lifetime warranty, so if you break it, you can get it replaced for your charge. Oh, That's nice. huge. A lot of kids will go out and they'll be like, oh, I'm going to get the disposable crap. Uh-uh. Because the disposable crap you're going to dispose of, you're going to spend money, and then you have to buy it again. So the money that you would use for other things, you're going to end up spending all this crap at the grocery store. Don't do it. Buy a chip or have it once, have it for life. That's the thing. You got your sippy cups. Let's say you're drinking and driving or whatever. This is perfect because you, this won't spill if you hit a baby or a raccoon or whatever. It's not going to spill. So that's going to be like that. Okay. And then it's got that drip of straw seal. So that seals up. <laughs> okay. So when you pull it out, it seals up. So stick it in and it opens. Pull it out. Seals up. Comes up. No, awesome. stick Good it in. Good. Pull it out. Stick it in. Pull it out. Something that you'll get used to in college. Anyway, so this is amazing. And let's say you're going to go to a, a, a cater party. You won't because you're so young and respectable. But someday you might. You can put your beer in here. You can put your wine. In your sippy cup. Yeah, in your sippy cup right, and look so like right. a Christian. Um, and then you're not going to get bugs in it when you're out at the park doing that thing. So, you know, stuff won't land in it because they'll be like, I can't get in. And then they'll leave. So this is amazing for that. Um, how many people uh, need jello shots to take to uh, oh, class? Because what that was for. Yeah, well, they have cupcakes on that side, but you put jello shots on this side. Look, someone already did. All right, and then this way you stack them up 34 jello shots go on there, and then you put this, you put it in place, lock it in place, and then you take it to class. Go, so you say, Hey, professor, I couldn't get my paper done on the mating habits of the Botswanian fruit fly because I was too busy making something delicious for you who just got extra credit. Delicious. You did, yeah. see, and when someone's riding their bike because they're so healthy and they ride into you you're not oh crap you know the gentle shots all over you because oh, yeah. they would just go spill inside there they'll be fine okay so then you can take them instead of i didn't spill them on the ground they're still in here because that whore that ran into me and probably dead now or in the river doesn't matter because your jello shots are attacked exactly. is well, there a preferred kind of jello shot no because the thing is now and i just was in the grocery store the other day now they're doing all kinds of different fun jello flavors okay. they're doing it extra fun flavors because I think finally they're figuring out, you know what, it's not just about banana jelly or whatever. Men want other things. So they have, I saw Jolly Ranch jelly shots or jelly the other day you can make jelly shots out of. I saw a couple, oh my lord, you know what I just saw? I saw mounds and, and uh, um, Almond Joy pudding. Oh, okay. So, you know, they're like expanding their, their whole brain and so they want you to put something in there. So you can make those pudding shots, which are great. So you put the vodka in there, tequila or whatever. And then the other ones you put in um, for your like lemon or lime or whatever new Jolly Rancher thing they're doing. It's very smart. They're very smart. They're looking for that hole in the market and they're filling the hole. So they're, they're just, that's what I like about them. Now this, how many people love um, ice cream? I was going to say sex, but we all know the answer to that one. But this is great if you want to have like ice cream Sundays. Everybody does their own okay. kind of toppings in there and you make your own. Or Taco Tuesday, let's say that you're having a night where you're studying too late. You get some friends over and you're drunk. You might not be, whatever. And then you put all the fixings in here. Everybody gets their favorite taco shell and you make a little taco. Or I understand that you can get marijuana in here. Well, there are different kinds of marijuana so that you put the different kinds in here. I want lead form madness or I don't know what they call it this tastes like honeysuckle roses this tastes like my grandma her name was Rose. Uh, whatever you put in, you put it in each kind, and then you can put the herb type seal on it, and then, uh, and then you can take that also to school with you. So the professor says, You want more to credit? Look what I did here, right? I don't, I don't, I'm just being smart about it. And I like this one because it can double for not even just food. You know, in our media office, we have people that have to worry about having kids all the time. So uh, we have different protection agencies. Isn't that, that amazing? You know, right I, on the front desk when you come in. Yes, I worry about having kids all the time. Yeah. They're gross and sticky and most won't imagine anything. So if you put different flavored condoms in yep, here, like you'd be like, hey, this one tastes like root beer. Exactly. I would yeah. like that right on my desk. Isn't that People good? Come in, yeah. This is an extra large one because, you know, it's you. It's like a magnum. It's rib for the place. It's got the reservoir tape in it.
Exactly. Yep. Well, it's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. So you can use that for all sorts of things. Aren't exactly. You so clever. See, I was thinking. I'm trying. I'm trying. I appreciate I'm trying that. To with you. Well, listen. Not everybody is smart, but you are going to change the world because you're going to protect people. I think it's since people have their red hair. I think that's yeah. There's not enough of us left. Yeah, exactly. You know, we're an endangered species. Wait, you can. Right. You should take one of us and, and put it on your mantle, like. Like a bobblehead dog. We're going to be so rare in the beginning now. They're going to be like, oh, who wants more redheads? Everybody does. That's why we should probably have more sex. Exactly. Yeah, redheads should statistically have more sex so we can statistically make more um, redheads. I would so agree. Even though we're recessive. I just think it's rude to say somebody's recessive. But I think it's nice that every minute now we're going to make more of us because we're going to have sex a lot. I agree. And we have one last piece. Oh, my Lord. Come on. Now, this is amazing because, first of all, everybody had it when they was a kid. Yeah. But did you know this is a perfect sobriety test? Did yeah. you know if you're drinking and driving, you can, before you do it, you go, hey, this is a, that shape. I don't know what that is. A, 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 it's a two. It has a two on it. It's got it's a two, two on it. It's shape two. Okay, and you say, where does it go? I don't know. I'm, I'm drunk. Oh, or I'm sober. So if you do this way, then you're going to stay at Avery's and sleep it off. And if you do this one, go right home. Take public transport. Get out. You're unwelcome. I'd be worried that even sober people, college students, can't get that. Well, that's a shame. I've met some people in my day. Well, maybe they need to get up there and smash and start doing this more. They're only 10 shapes. Each of them are numbered. Just figure it out. It's not that hard. You know? And then some people go in there and try to, they're going to try to say, they're going to do this. So they're like, you know what? I'm going to try to beat the system. I'm just going to pull it open and do this. I'm going to pull it up. Oh, see that? Tupperware solved everything. If you try to pull it open and put the shapes in, they're going to fall out the bottom. Mm -hmm. So who's the loser there? Somebody that's not smart. Exactly. So this makes you smart. And if you're not smart, you might as well just move because you're screwing up our statistics. <laughs> All right? And I don't like that. I like it's not to be smart. Because smart people are the ones who do more things to help the world. Dumb people just take up resources. And then, you know, they get in that trailer, and then the trailer ends up blowing into a different zip code, and then you got to deal with them, and then you got new neighbors after a storm, and then you got to bake zucchini bread, and I'm sorry, my zucchini is reserved for other things. So, you know, I don't need anybody stupid people blowing into my next door neighbor exactly. in my trailer, and buddy now, and like, hey, can I borrow a cup of money or a chainsaw? No, you can't, because you should have stayed in school and learned how to stick the checks in the hall. I know, I mean, I'm, I do what I can, I'm a giver. Perfect. The is there any other cup where you want? You know what? There's tons of stuff in the show. There's tons of stuff in the catalog. Yeah. I couldn't bring it all with me today because I'm not a Sherpa or a pack mule and I don't have all that space to do it. But your friends can come and see the program and then learn about all kinds of other stuff. Perfect. You know? And that's the good thing. The you know, get the catalog and buy stuff. You can get set, you know what? You can say to your mama, hey, you know, uh, I'm going to go to school in the fall and I need food storage because she's thinking you're going to want something stupid. But if you say, I need some Tupperware, she's yep. going to be like, my baby is going to be so amazing. <laughs> because you've asked a really smart add-up question. You want food storage to be, be able to help you with your needs. If it's going to last forever. And she's like, that's a good investment. I'm going to get that for you. You're going to be eating better at school. Everything's going to stay fresher longer. You're not going to throw stuff away. You're going to take that savings and turn it into something else. More condoms for your condom tray. Say that. Perfect. So smart. Well, thank you so much for this demonstration. Honey, for you, anything. And I mean that. I would get out the ceiling fan and the midget and the trampoline and the goat, and I would do that thing by my bed where I lift my leg real high because I know somebody that's in the circus. For you, that's how much I like to be perfect. Thank you. My pleasure.